What's really dope about this Swingman jersey is something that you don't normally see on Swingman jerseys. Maybe I got lucky and I got a little extra feature on it, but I don't normally see it and let me show you guys. This one has to be one of my favorite statement edition jersey, not just because of the player. Okay, maybe, a little more biased, but <laughs> like this, I mean, look at this. The thing with this design, I think it's like similar to a couple years ago's earned edition jerseys when they were doing it. Like you got bucks on the side. Man, it, I don't know. I'm really keen on this colorway. And uh, let's just check out the details. It's, it's my guy, Drew Holiday. Starting off the collar, you got that rib material. You got a three-tone colorway. You got that blue, the green, and cream. All colorways that the Bucks have been using the last couple years. Arm openings, the same. Standard heat press, Jerry West. You got Drew Holiday, single. Well, I was gonna say single stitch. Nah, it's heat pressed. It's a swing man. I wish it was authentic. And then right here you got cream and then you got green trim. Pretty much your standard stuff. Dry fit advance at the bottom. And then when we peek at the side, you could see the cream colorway of the horns and that's sublimated into the fabric so they don't die. I mean, well, not die like, they don't come off. And that's the back of the jersey. And on the front side, you got the same style. Goes into a V-neck collar. And then the arm openings, you got the same thing. And then the information here, it's kind of like light, but it's sublimated on. Then you got the jump man, cannot go wrong with that. You got Bucks 21, similar font, pretty much actually I think the same font that they usually use. Bucks, numbering, same style. And then you can see the horns really pop out on the front of the jersey, which is dope. But, the one thing that's different, pretty much standard here, usually on the Swingman jerseys, this fear, the deer, or like anything writing on top, they're usually screen printed. This one's actually heat pressed on. Did I get lucky? But look at that. <laughs> I don't know if they just built it like that. Can anyone else confirm? And that is the front of the jersey. And this is what it looks like when you wear the jersey. First off, I forgot to mention, I got this at Shield Sports. So basically, it's like Dick's Sporting Goods of the Midwest. So I saw this, they had it in inventory and they don't even have this at the Bucks Pro Shop or like Dick's Sporting Goods. So I had to go grab this. But look at this. Bucks across the chest, Jumpman, you can't go wrong with that. Like, and I like that, I mean, the Jumpman here feels a little more rubberized. So like the quality of the Jumpman feels a little bit nicer. So I did like that and this is how it should be. Cause sometimes I get some jerseys that it just feels a little lighter, like a bad quality type. So it just depends. But what's really dope, you got like the horns, the deer horns coming out the side, a sleek black jersey. You got the green trim around the lettering and numbering. And then the little uh, fear of the deer actually heat pressed on a swing man jersey. Usually it's screen printed with Swingmans and then the authentic versions, they do get the uh, actual heat press portion. Maybe I got lucky. And then, come on man, Drew Holiday. That's the jersey. Man, I really do like the jersey. I, the earned edition one of this, like it had a similar design or pretty much the same. I can't think of it off the top of my head, but um, I didn't really like the colorway. So this one, more my style, really do like it. So as a uh, statement edition jersey, even though it's a swing man, like I gotta give it either like a, like a mid like four. Okay, biased four. Should be like 3.5 to four for me. The authentic runs look crazy, crazy nice. Like they only have the Giannis one available, of course, right? The Greek freak. But that's gonna be at the Bucks Pro Shop. That's the only place I've seen it. So if you're interested in the authentic run of this, I'll have the Bucks Pro Shop in the description. And man, what do you guys think about this? Let me know in the comments below. And hey, thanks again for watching y'all and on to the next video.